This is a uh, Russian queen that I started this summer from Foley's Russian Bees. I'm doing a, a Varroa mite inspection and I am finding mites on the bees. I'm finding workers with the wings eaten. Um, I've got Italian. I had Italians for five years. I wanted to switch to Russians to see if they were any better. <laughs> and I'm finding the same results. I treat them all the same. I do powdered sugar every month now. And I find no difference whatsoever with the mite problems. And my first order, I ordered 20 and 18 were alive. So then I thought, okay, that's pretty good. So then the next order, a month later, I ordered 22 and he sent some extras and some to replace the ones I lost. So there was 26 inside this box. Upon arrival, three of them were dead. Now he doesn't put the workers in the cage with the queen. He packs them in the box and what happens is there's so many workers in there and they get hot and they cover the screens blocking off all ventilation. If you read on here it says keep at room temperature. Keep well ventilated. Keep out of the sun. They're not supposed to get hot. If they get hot they're doomed. So anyway, on arrival, next day air from UPS, three of them were dead. Three days later and I checked, three more were dead. So that's six out of 20. And then a week later, I can't find queens. So basically a month later, I've got no queens out of 26. Over $800 I paid for these. So if you count the, the first order and the second order, it's a total of 42, $1,500 that I paid for basically 18, 20 queens. It's about $80 a piece. And I'm having the same issues with mites that I have with Italians. They're not worth the money, trust me. Don't buy from Foley's Russian Bees. Um, on my next video, I'm going to show you guys how to make your own queens. Make some free queens. Yes, you're going to have problems with mites, but yeah, you're not going to pay $80 for a queen, too. So, stay tuned. I'll show you another video on how to make free queens. Thank you.